Hello YouTube, and welcome to another redstone tutorial. Um, I'm sure some of you have seen my uh, TNT run map, or play TNT run on Hypixel server. Um, anyway, I made a map, a TNT run in vanilla Minecraft. As I believe it's time I sh shared how I did it. Ooh, that's a lot of leg. That's a lot of leg. Okay. On up. All right. Well, uh, that's an automatic leg. Anyway, as you can see, it just—it's replacing the blocks. <sighs> okay, I will. Wow. Um, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Uh, that was an automatic leg. I, that hasn't happened before. Uh, but anyway. So, it's actually, all you need are these five command blocks down here. The, these ones up here just do the redstone clock. Um, but anyway, so, this is another, it uses the exe execute command again, where it tests for, if you're facing a certain direction, at all players facing a certain direction, it will set the block below them one below them and one behind them to air. Yeah, I know on the Hypixel server that it removes the block underneath you. The issue is I was having trouble getting the timing right for that. So I had to put it one block behind. And this basically does it for every direction you're looking. Of course, this can be used for more than just TNT run. It could be You can make a bunch of them and make it so when you're running in a certain direction the floor is coming out from underneath you. Um, and, uh, so, yeah. There's a lot you can do with this, with this, um, redstone stuff, but, so, as you can see, it doesn't only remove the blocks down here, but everywhere else, too. But it's a very, very, very interesting thing you can now do in vanilla Minecraft. I mean... There's so much you can do with the execute command. I am so happy Mojane, uh, Mojane added this to uh, to Minecraft. But so anyway, I guess that's it for right now. Um, I will see you later. Bye.